Ooh, am I on the naughty list? So today, if you couldn't tell, I have my little Christmas tree up and I guess I'm just gonna talk about Christmas and things that I like about Christmas. So yeah, let's get into that. Okay, so I guess a little like story about Christmas is like when I was younger, I would always wake up at like five in the morning and wake my mom up or like whoever was with us at the time. Like I would wake everyone up at five in the morning so that we could open presents and it didn't always go that way. They usually would go back to sleep. Like every year that I got older, they decided to go back to sleep. I woke them up at five in the morning and so everyone got up and we all opened presents and then the adults went back to sleep for a couple of hours and then we ate breakfast and watched the parade and everything and like that was always one of my favorite memories is like waking up super early just to open presents and then going back to sleep but now now I'm like the last one to wake up like everyone's trying to wake me up on Christmas and it's not because I don't want to wake up and open my presents and spend time with my family and eat and all that because that all sounds like, amazing like I cannot wait for Christmas it's almost here so Merry almost Christmas everyone is always trying to wake me up now on Christmas and but it's like I pick my presents out every year almost so it's like I'm only surprised with a couple of presents a year so it's like I know what I'm getting so I mean I'm still excited and I'm really like thankful for everything that I'm getting but like the surprise isn't there anymore like I just don't feel like waking up early anymore I'm not a morning person not even on Christmas I'm sorry okay so this is the first Christmas that me my mom and my dad are not spending with my mom's mom and dad and that's a long story um that they're not dead or anything we just had some family drama and it got out of hand and they don't want us there so we had our first thanksgiving at home and that was amazing like my mom is such a like a, such a good cook and she was like really doubting herself and I was like, dude, mom, your food is awesome. Props to you, mom. I think we're just gonna have sandwiches and like stuff like that because mom went. Shut up. I'll be back. I am filming a fucking barking video. This little turd won't stop barking, will ya? Say hi, Coda. Look at Paul though. You're not getting on my bed. Sorry about ya. Noah, come here. Come here, poop. This is the other baby. Okay, so. <laughs> Hi. So, yeah, this is the first Christmas that we're not spending with him, and we're just gonna have sandwiches and all of that because mom went full out on Thanksgiving, and I was really proud of her. I really hope that everyone has a really good Christmas and you get everything that you wanted and asked for. Just be really thankful. It's Christmas. A lot of people aren't getting things that they asked for because people there's less fortunate people out there and that's one thing that I want to do like when I get a job I want to I want to donate to charity and like give kids things that they never had before. Stop it. You guys are terrible when I'm filming. Just sit there. Get up there like Coda is. <laughs> so I hope you have a very Merry Christmas. Stop, look at the camera. Oh, what are you doing? Look, I hope you have. <laughs> okay, do you not want to be in it or something? I hope you have a very Merry Christmas. Merry Christmas and I'll see you in 2016. Bye.